might might as well begin playing. Um, there we go. Might as well die right away. Going for the first on-screen death. That's that's the way. That's the way to do it. Well, that was fun. What shall we do tomorrow? I'm going to save my game. We are just getting started. And time for uh, those of you who saw my most frustrating King's Quest test D list from a while ago may remember this. This moving rock rolls downhill, and you, unfortunately, are in the way. The physics don't exactly uh, work out, but... But then if I do... Time to go into the Roaring Rapids. Your swimming attempt proved fatal. Sometimes it's a uh, trial or error uh, if you don't know already which, which bits of water you can swim in and which ones you can't. Oh, I died. I was swimming for too long. Save and a beanstalk. I think we're going to go normal speed while we're climbing. <laughs> That's why it's so easy to fall. And if I fall on any screen other than this one, I will be dead. I did not step off. What the fuck? The parts of these games I'm always worst at are the hand-eye coordination parts, especially because uh, they weren't great at designing them. Let's try way over here. Nope. It didn't make less sense. Like I said, if I had gotten it wrong and just gotten the key, it would have been less tedious. We're going to have another hour of this. No, no, this is all part of it. It's not a real King's Quest playthrough experience without something really frustrating and tedious. There we go. There we go. Here we go. And dead. <laughs> he landed on his ass and then just collapsed face first after that. We are delighted by your score and hope you're enjoying the game. Nope. Okay, maybe I just go straight up. Straight up as far as I can and then see what happens. <laughs> okay, so straight up until I'm behind that vine and then I go over. Inch by inch, we're going to get there. Oh, 
bit by bit, piece by piece, brick by brick, talk by tick. Nope, too far. Save, still on second screen. Oh, so close. It would be easier if the graphics gave any indication of, you know, anything. <laughs> But it's like Graham's just waving his hands like this. Okay. This sort of thing is how they artificially increase the length of these Sierra games. Third screen. Oh, this one's... Well, it was easier. This is what these games were like. Okay, let's just watch me fall all the way down. <laughs> These games were exercises in punishing the players. Nope. What? Did I save down there? Sorry, I was thrown off by just suddenly being behind. By just suddenly being behind the vine I was in front of a second ago. Why does that keep happening? I might have done something wrong already. I might be like... Oh, I see. That's the problem. I kept saving from the autosave, which I didn't even know it was was a thing. <sighs> all right. Look, this is all well and good, but I have to go to the bathroom. So I will be back in just a moment. I'm going to try something else. If I try going down here and go around this way. Nope, no better. I'm still trying to remember if I took a specific wrong step or something. Like, like if I'm, if I back myself into a place that I cannot, uh, No, wait. Fuck. Uh, 
Um, I haven't seen much of the new Looney Tunes cartoons yet, but I like what I've been seeing. Oh, we're gonna be here forever. I am going to... Well, see, but I don't have years of Let's Playing experience like he does, so oh, so close. I feel like I'm almost there. Okay, let's see exactly how far up I can go here. Aha, I'm clipping through that. God damn it, so close. Am I supposed to be like on the other side of this vine? Is that what's happening here? Save. Nope. Come on, we can do this. Again, this is your reward for correctly guessing the impossible puzzle that is the gnome's name. You're rewarded with this bullshit. Okay, and then I have to, there we go. Okay, I made it to the land of the clouds. Up there, there was so much room. 